Hi, I'm Beth with 50 Plus Beauty, and I'm excited that you're here with me today to hear my new thoughts on derma rolling. Now, many of you may know that about 11 months ago when I started my channel, I was derma rolling my lips and my face. And I did the face derma rolling for about two or three months, and then I stopped. And this video is going to tell you exactly why I stopped. Now, I am still derma rolling my lips. I do it about every two weeks, and I feel like it's really having good results. Now, for those of you who aren't familiar with derma rolling, it's this little tiny derma rolling device, and you use that at home, and it has different lengths of metal quills. These happen to be steel or titanium steel. And these are a 0.5 derma roller, and that's what I use on my lips. And then I also use this 1.5 derma roller. Actually, I have two of them. I use one on my hairline, and there was a wonderful video by Elle, and you have to go see Elle's channel if you have never done so before. I'm sure most of you know her because she's got a really great channel, really large channel, but she is absolutely delightful. She is this absolutely beautiful blonde. She's filled with common sense. She does her videos from Arizona, from outside, and so she always shows you these humming birds every video and she has this wonderful heart and she's really able to share a lot about her life and a lot about her tips on success with you she's a phenomenal woman she did a great video on how using the derma roller on her hairline was really affecting her hairline in a very positive way and I'll put a link to that video below and I am going to be doing a video on exactly that same topic sharing my results on my hairline with you so if you're not a subscriber I hope you go ahead and subscribe that way you can see my video on derma rolling my hairline and I'm also going to have some other videos on derma rolling and the scientific research behind the various things that it does improve. Now this video is to tell you my new thoughts on derma rolling. Basically it boils down to this. After I had used the derma roller maybe about three months on my face, I had a couple of viewers make comments under the comment section of my derma rolling video, and they both said that they had realized that they were getting little tiny scars all over their face from derma rolling. One of them in particular, she looked in the mirror and she realized that she had a little grid pattern of derma rolling scars all over her face. And at about the same time she said that, I had been derma rolling my skin and I wasn't seeing any positive results, I have to be honest with you. And one of the main things I wanted to use the derma roller for was to shrink my large pores. And it seemed to me that after derma rolling, it seemed like I was getting even more little holes all over my face. And that was probably my imagination, but that coupled with those two viewers' comments made me think I need to stop and I need to do some real research about the derma rolling. And so I actually went online to some scientific databases and looked up a lot of different research on derma rolling. What I found is that derma rolling has been scientifically proven to treat three different kinds of problems. The first is acne scarring, and that's actually how the derma rolling got its start, I think back in the early 90s or late 80s, was on improving acne scarring. And I'll show you one of the little studies, and there are many studies in the scientific research about acne scarring and the derma roller, and here is just one of them. In this study, they took 37 patients who had acne scarring, and those are those pitted indented scars, not the raised scars, because derma rolling has not been proven to affect the raised scars. They had 36 total patients that made it through to the end of the study. It was three to four sessions over three to four months. So they did the derma rolling with a 1.5 quill derma roller, which is this one here. It was a medical grade one though, I'm sure, because they did it in a medical setting. You can see the before and after picture there. And in that study, 80% of the patients rated their results as just excellent. They were very, very pleased. And derma rolling is very effective and probably the most effective on dealing with acne scarring. Another area in which derma rolling really excels is in treating alopecia. And the studies that have been done have been done in males, but basically the derma roll plus the minoxidil has been shown to grow hair. And here is a look at one of those studies. This was a 12-week study, and again, the derma rolling was done once every 30 days. Here is a before and after picture, and as you can see, it's very, very compelling that the derma roller is helping these participants grow hair. And the third area in which the derma roller has been studied to good results is in the area of dealing with stretch marks. And this really surprises me, and there's a certain way that they do the stretch marks. It's not necessarily just using the derma roller on the stretch marks, but they do use a longer needle derma roller. In this study, they're using the one here is a look at one of the studies which looked at stretch marks and the derma roller. And here is just one of the before and after pictures from the study. And there's a lot that goes into how they treated the stretch marks in that study, so I will be doing another video about that down the road. And again, stretch marks was an area in which derma rolling was proven to be helpful. But since I was most interested in the effects of derma rolling on one's face in terms of anti-aging, that's what I was looking for in terms of the research. And friends, it is just not there. You can find derma rolling studies on acne scars, on hair growth, and on stretch marks, 
but there really aren't any studies at all on general anti-aging. And when I was having my Mohs surgery, I talked to my plastic surgeon about derma rolling and he agreed. He said there really aren't any studies right now that are saying that derma rolling does anything positive for one's face and derma rolling in the wrong hands can really lead to scarring. And so what I do in terms of my derma rolling now is that every two weeks I do derma roll my lips and I also derma roll just these nasal wrinkles right here, these nasal labial folds. And I do that because I know I'm not going to scar because I can just very easily and simply go down and do the number of passes that I need and it's not like I'm going all over my face where I could really injure myself because you can injure yourself by either having a quill that is sticking out wrong and jutting into your skin wrong or that you just get in too big of a hurry and you're making passes on your face and moving the derma roller around and you end up ripping your skin. And I'm also derma rolling my hairline once in the evening and I'll be doing a video with those results. So that is a look at where I am right now with my thoughts on derma rolling. And again, if you're not a subscriber, go ahead and subscribe and click that little bell. That way you'll be notified of my future videos because I am going to be doing other videos on derma rolling and giving you a little more information about it because I think it is a really good tool. Now, I always like to leave you with a little thought for the day. And I've been using this card deck by Louise Hay, the Life Loves You cards. And let's see what God in the universe has in store for us today. Here's a good one. I live in an abundant universe. I live in an abundant universe. Notice how abundance flows into your life in delightful and surprising ways. I have been working on the idea that instead of concentrating on lack and maybe a few of the things that I don't think I have, I have to kind of stop myself and reframe and go, no, I live in an abundant universe. I'm grateful for all the wonderful things I have. I have my health, I have my family, I have my job. Life is good. And friends, I'm convinced that the more we concentrate on abundance and are grateful for it, the more abundance flows into our life. Take care. See you next time.